guys, and welcome to your Two Minute Money Manager. I'm your host, Stacey Johnson, and this answer is brought to you by MoneyTalksNews.com, serving up the best in personal finance news and advice since 1991. Today's question comes to us from Gary. Gary says, what happens to my parents' IRA after they pass if I'm to inherit it? Now, I'm glad you asked that question, Gary, because the rules for inherited retirement accounts changed pretty recently at the end of 2019, along with other rules around retirement accounts. Now, there was there's a, a, a bill. I'm, I'll go ahead and tell you the whole name, but it doesn't really matter. The Setting Every Community Up for Retirement Enhancement Act. You'll hear it called the SECURE Act. That was signed in law in December 2019, took effect in, in January of 2020, changed a few rules when it comes to retirement accounts. Let's go over some of the key changes. Number one, no more age limit. The maximum age for contributing to an IRA was 70 and a half. Thanks to the SECURE Act, now there's no age limit. As long as you have income from working, you can contribute. Number two, required minimum distributions. You used to have to start taking money out of your retirement accounts no later than the year you turned 70 and a half. Now, those required minimum distributions, also known as RMDs, don't start until the year you reach 72 years old. Number three, uh, now we're allowed, to, some part-time employees are now allowed to participate in an employer-sponsored retirement plan. Used to be employers could exclude part-time employees. Now some of them, and there are restrictions, but some of them will be allowed to join uh, their, their employer-sponsored retirement plans. Number four, the, the new law allows small businesses to join together to offer retirement plans. So they can get better deals if small businesses band together. Now, these are changes that potentially benefit millions of people, but let's get back to Gary's question and talk about how the SECURE Act is going to change the rules for inherited IRAs. Before the SECURE Act, if you inherited retirement money from accounts like IRAs, you could make withdrawals over your lifetime, thus stretching out that tax bill. Now, the SECURE Act ended that so-called stretch IRA strategy. Now, when you inherit an IRA or the retirement plan, you have to take all the money out and pay all the taxes on it within 10 years. There are, however, exceptions. The 10-year requirement does not apply if you're a surviving spouse, if you're disabled, if you're chronically ill, a minor child, or someone with fewer than 10 years, or that's fewer than 10 years younger than that original IRA owner. Now, you'll note, though, that Gary, as a son, doesn't get any of those uh, exceptions. So he would have to take all that money out within 10 years of inheriting that IRA. So the bottom line for Gary, if you inherit an IRA from your parents, you're going to be withdrawing that money and paying the income taxes on it over no more than a 10-year period. Hope that helps you, Gary. How about you folks? You got a question of your own? Then do what Gary did. Simply hit reply to the Daily Money Talks email and fire away. And if you're not getting our newsletter, you need to fix that right now. Go to moneytalksnews.com and subscribe. It's free, takes five seconds, and it will absolutely positively make you richer. I'm Stacy Johnson. I'm going to see you right here next time.